What's up, everybody? This is your girl, EJ. And really quickly, it's giving peacock. And I want to make a peacock noise, but girl, I don't know how peacock sounds, so. This video has been brought to you by EJ Speaks and her upcoming shows. You can meet her first in Philadelphia, then Atlanta, then here are the dates, okay? Subscribe to my website, ejspeaks.com, to make sure you don't miss anything. Now back to your regularly, now back to your regularly, now back to your regularly scheduled program. Girl, I couldn't do a commercial if I tried. So if you anything like me, when somebody asks you, what do you want for your birthday? You probably don't tell them what you want. You probably play your birthday down. You probably say something politically correct like, oh, it don't even matter. Oh, just, just get whatever you want. You know what? As long as it comes from your heart, that's all that matters. That's a lie because sometimes people's hearts be, mm -mm, it be wrong. And then a lot of times our birthday will come and we think all of these gifts are just gonna start pouring in. All these cash apps, Zales and PayPal's just gonna start flowing in. And a lot of times they don't. And 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 that 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 be that be making me mad right there. So you go through your special day, your birthday, and you don't get the thing you want or you don't get that super special gift. Even though you say it, it don't matter. As long as it come from your heart then. So now on your birthday, you got a whole bunch of it don't matters, which actually converts into nothing most of the time. So now you mad. If y'all have been following me for a while, you know that I've had a hard time celebrating my birthday. I don't like a lot of attention and as odd as it may sound, I don't like the spotlight being on me. But also it's a little bit of crazy mixed in there because I'll tell people don't get me anything or it don't matter or get something from the heart. And then when I come up short on my birthday, I'm feeling some type of way. Mainly because when it's somebody else's birthday, I'll shoot them a cash app or a sweet little encouraging text message. I be showing up for the birthdays is what I'm saying. So to not get at least that same thing in return, of course I feel some type of way. Okay, but this year I decided it was going to be different. This year I decided that I was going to put it out there. I was going to give people something to work with and I was going to enjoy my birthday. Here's what I did. A couple of weeks before my birthday, I get in a family group text. I give them my wish list. Now because my birthday is in October, I was like, let me just give them my birthday list and my Christmas list all in one. So that way, if maybe something takes a little bit more time, maybe it can't come on my birthday, but they can get it for Christmas. Or maybe they need a little time to save up a couple coins. So we'll get the smaller stuff now, and then the bigger stuff, when we get our money right, that'll be on time for Christmas. You see what I did? You see what I did? They didn't ask for this wish list, but girl, they needed it because every time, ooh, they don't be getting it right. Again, I sent out a wish list. Do y'all know that when my birthday came, all the things that I got were all the things I wanted. Did I make it too easy for them? Who who asking that? Cause that, that don't even matter at this point. Cause I got what I wanted. The point is, although we know nobody can read our minds. No, for real, they can't read our minds. We have to tell people what we want, especially when we're known to play our special days down or we're known not to really celebrate ourselves. Throughout that transition of not celebrating yourself to celebrating yourself, you may just have to give some assistance. And that's all right because do you want the gift or not? Now, of course, it takes the surprise out of things. Who need a surprise? Me, I don't need a surprise. I'm, I'm grown. So I just wanted to give that really helpful tip that if you want something, girl, let it be known. Stop lying to people year after year saying it don't matter as long as it comes from the heart. Oh, don't give me nothing. And then you feel a way when it goes exactly the way you spoke it to go. Girl, I done quit doing it. I'm, I'm going to be using my wish list like for everything. Mother's Day, birthday, Christmas, Thanksgiving, Easter, wish list activated. All right, now as always, I wanna hear from you. How do you handle your birthdays, anniversaries, special days? Like how do you handle them? Do you say exactly what you want? Or do you say, oh, it don't matter, whatever comes from the heart, and then feel away, whether out loud or secretly, when they don't get you what you didn't say you wanted. I wanna hear all about it. Thank you guys so very much for tuning in. This is your girl, EJ, and I will see you guys next time.